Hi there, good morning. Well, it's lovely, lovely, lovely to have you here with me again today. Thank you for joining me. Well, I don't know if you remember a TV advert that used to be on, I think a few years ago. It was a deep heat advert and it says, if it were easy, everyone would do it. Here's to not being everyone Go the distance. Go the distance. Well, you and I, we were created by the Most High God. You were created by the Most High God and I was created by the Most High God. We've all been given different gifts, different talents that He has given us. Uh, The person maybe that is sitting next to you today, they cannot do the unique things that you were called to do. I maybe cannot do the unique things that you were called to do. God has given you amazing talents to accomplish all he wants you to do. All the plans, all the purposes that he wants for your life. He's given you those gifts, those talents so that you can accomplish those things. Well, God took time to make you one amazing individual. You are one amazing person by God, made and created by this great and awesome God. We know in Psalms 139 verses 13 and 14, it says, you, that's God, you made all the delicate inner parts of my body and you knit me together in my mother's womb. Thank you for making me so wonderfully complex. Your workmanship is marvelous. How well I know it. I love that. Well, you are handpicked. I am handpicked. You are chosen. I am chosen by God. Why? We're chosen to go the distance. We're chosen to go the distance today. 1 Peter chapter 2 verse 9 says, But you are not like that. For you, you, this is who God's speaking to. You are a chosen people. You are a royal priest, a holy nation, God's very own possession. As a result, you can show others the goodness of God. Wow, you are a chosen people. You are a royal priest. You are a holy nation. You are God's very own possession. And because of that, as a result of that, you can go out and show others the goodness of God. Okay, why? Because he called you, the scripture says, out of darkness, right into his wonderful, marvelous light. How amazing is that? This is what our God has done for us. Well, the gifts and the talents that he has given you are unique, as we said earlier on. With your personality and your giftings that he has given you, uh, you can go out and give something so special to the people around you. Are you using them? I want to ask you today, are you using your gifts and your talents And are you going the distance to be a blessing to the people around you? Well, 1 Peter 4 verse 10 says, God has given each of you a gift from his great variety of of spiritual gifts. Use them well to serve one another. Use them well. God has given us uh, gifts from his great variety of spiritual gifts Use them well. Why? So that we can be a servant to the others, to people around us. I know um, it's not always easy. Life can get tough. But one thing I know that I know that I know is that my God, your God, will never fail you. He has invested too much in you today. He's invested too much in me. He takes time out for you. He takes time out for you today. He knows you well. He knows you so well. The next time you may be sitting in a group or standing in a group and you're feeling like you're just one of everyone there in the room. You're just an everyone. Well, you are not. You can know that you are known. You are created by an awesome God. You are created by an awesome God and an amazing God. He knows everything about you. This is God. He knows everything about you today. And he desires to bless you. He desires to bless you. Well, I want to end by reading Psalm 139 verse 2 uh, to verse 5. It says, you know, that's us saying to God, this is David when he was speaking about God, you know when I sit down or when I stand up, you know my thoughts 
even when I am far away. You see me when I travel and when I rest at home. You know everything I do. You know what I'm going to say even before I say it, Lord. You go before me and you follow me. You place your hand of blessing on my head. Well, be encouraged today. Be strengthened today. You are unique and go the distance. Go the distance. Go the distance what God has given inside of you to accomplish for him even in today. Be blessed and we'll chat again tomorrow. Have a lovely, lovely day. Bye-bye.